last official day where the uh, Canadian Wheat Board uh, is not is a single desk seller. And tomorrow, August 1st, 2012, uh, the market will open up and the private grain companies will take control. This is an agency that uses skilled selling uh, to improve uh, farmers' income from the marketplace. They want to propose uh, replacing this skilled selling with a casino-style marketing system that has failed farmers in the past. It becomes very difficult for a farmer to decide what is the best time to sell and what's the best time to hold your grain. Uh, you have only one chance to make that decision with the K and Wheat Board. They're selling all the time. We were, we were getting uh, access to uh, you know, markets in 70 countries in the world. Now we have only access to about three major grain companies. And that's a reduction in farmers' choice as to how much we can, or where we can sell our grain. Those grain companies are going to claim a bigger profit. They admit they're going to take a bigger profit. And, uh, and they're quite happy about it. And what does that do to our farm income? It, it, it reduces our farm income. And the Cayenne Wheat Board was able to take that profit and return that, that profit to us as farmers. And this is the switch that's happened. It's, it's just like, like turning farmers loose in a casino. We're all on our own now. Grain companies can take advantage of that like the house can take advantage of a, of a patron. We were a farmer-controlled uh, agency. There's no farmer control in grain marketing anymore.